guys, Matt, Mike, Minecraft Garage, uh, working on the Ford Free T today. So uh, we got the steering project mostly wrapped up other than doing the tie rod in the front, which we're going to get to shortly. Um, we are moving along pretty good. So one thing we need to get done, uh, because the engine has just been sitting on some box tubing or a jack, uh, or the transmission rather, we got to get a uh, cross member made for the frame in the center here and also get a trans mount made. So we're going to tackle getting that uh, made up today and that will get it so that the engine and trans are truly bolted in place and we can kind of keep working around with all the suspension stuff uh, from there. So we got some plates cut. Yeah, we got some, it's like 3 sixteenths yes, it is, yeah. plate, roughly quarter plate. Cut. We cover the plasma already. We're actually at on point today. We got everything prepped and ready to go before we started filming. So we're not running around like chickens with our heads cut off trying to get things done. So we got plate cut, we got uh, like flat stock for the top and bottom to make flanges, and then we got some angle cut so we can actually uh, weld it into the car on the sides of the side of the frame. Room, so yeah, it'll, have, it'll have little ears on it so that way it butts to the inside, gives a little extra uh, strength. And we made the uh, the plate pretty pretty wide. I took measurements off of a set of uh, Ford F1 pickup pedals. Uh, if, you're, if you're not familiar with those, the nice thing with those pedals are in like 48 to 51 or 52 uh, trucks, the master cylinder was built into the pedal cluster and it all bolts into this center cross member. Uh, so we're kind of copying that original design or making it fit this 46 Ford frame and how the engine's sitting. So, uh, when we're all set and done, we should be able to drill holes, bolt the pedals in, and then we can start modifying the pedals to make them uh, fit in this little freaking soup can of the building. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so we're, we're going to start tack welding, getting everything set up, and uh, hopefully we should start moving on pretty quick. Now that the trans cross member is fully welded, we need to bend the ears to match the taper of the frame. We do so with a torch and a pair of pliers and continue to heat until we're able to bend the ears to the exact angle that we need.
cross member all built. Uh, Mike and Jay got the uh, the ends here heated and bent, and everything fits up. Got a tack. Let you do the welding work today. Yeah, got the pedals in. Everything's pretty much ready to go. We do need to shorten the F1 pedals quite a bit for this T-cal. It's, uh, it's going to be a little tight with pedals, so we got to do some figuring out of what we need to shorten where and all that good stuff. So good for now. We can start on uh, getting floors in this thing, getting the trans tunnel and all that stuff built. So This is the first time the engine and trans have been like, they bolt in. We had box tubing holding up before, but now the engine's all level. And uh, we can start cutting away for the torque tube, like uh, that would get us get us going. So because we actually rolled this outside. Drop some photos. In yeah, I got some photos at the end. I'll drop in. We rolled it outside. We had to move some things around in the shop, and this thing looks absolutely killer. He awesome. was like a little schoolgirl. Yeah, it's awesome, and it looks tiny. It's like the top of the bodies at like the tires on a pickup truck. It's insane. It's uh, this thing's gonna be a death trap and awesome. So. Yes. Uh, yeah, we'll get working on some other stuff, but uh, that's all we got for the free tea for this week. Thanks guys for watching. Enjoy.